this is the result of the air hype timo y'all look at the side by side comparison i am literally blown away hey y'all what's up and welcome back to another video of as always Aaliyah, where we always keep it real now y'all my hair has been in this bun for about three days now and i just been so unmotivated to do my hair but when i got the timo air hype in the mail i am so excited to review this product for you guys and we're gonna finally take my hair out of this bun let's go ahead and blow dry my hair and review the air hype by timo All right, y'all, so like I said, my hair has been in this bun for like three days. I washed my hair. I just felt really unmotivated to do anything with it, so it's still a little bit damp. So here's how we're looking with our hair, and we are just going to be blow drying it straight. I'm going for a full, light, fluffy look today, and I think this hair tool will do just that. So again, this is the Air Hype Light. It's a high-speed hair dryer by Timo, and apparently, this is a really good dupe for the Dyson. So let's go ahead and check it out. We're going to go ahead and unbox it right now. Something fall, yes. <laughs> okay, so the thing that fell was just the instruction manual. It's like a guide that has how to work and use the air hype. And then here is the actual dryer. So here's what we are looking like. Now there is a protection layer on here of plastic, so we're just gonna pull all of that off. Okay, oh, I love how this is like a matte finish. That is beautiful. Do you guys see it? Wow, that is really, really pretty. I love, love how um, the feel of the blow dryer and I like the color. It's like a matte black. It's very, very pretty and even it even has engraved air hype on the back, which is pretty cool. This is the attachment that I received with my blow dryer. All right, y'all, so I did some digging and I found another attachment blow dryer, another attachment piece, and this is supposed to be able to fit onto this blow dryer. It's from another Timo dryer. So we're just gonna use it just like that. And like I mentioned, I really want you guys to know if you are somebody who is on a budget, it just doesn't have the extra funds to spend on a $400 blow dryer, then this is definitely the dupe for you. That People compare the Timo Air Hype to the Dyson as a really good dupe the timo air hype is going to run you about 70 to 80 dollars versus like a dyson which is going to be a couple hundred dollars okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and plug this in i'm just looking at all the different buttons on here i do see an on off switch in the back and there's also a cool setting as well anytime you are looking at a new blow dryer you want to find ones that have a cool setting on them just in case you don't want to use heat and you want to use a cool airflow this can do so so that's pretty cool there's also a um speed and a temperature on here as well so we'll get into how fast and how hot this um blow dryer actually gets but i think we're going to either use low or cool heat for this and there is a velcro strap so we're going to take that off we're going to plug it in and we're going to get to work. So what we're going to do, I just want you guys to see all the buttons so you might not be able to hear me because I am going to go ahead and turn this on just so you can see the different buttons here. So bear with me. So you see how those two lights came on? The white one is for the airflow and the orange one is the heat setting. This airflow is crazy. Like, it's really, really high speed. Oh my goodness. That's kind of nice. Let me show you guys what else we're going to be using to complete this hairstyle today. So, I have here with me just a parting comb because I am going to part my hair down the middle. It's just going to be a lot easier for me to go ahead and blow dry that way. And since my hair is dry, I am going to be using a wide tooth comb first just to kind of get those knots out. And then we'll either go in with the paddle comb just to make sure that all the knots are really combed out, or I might just just go right in with the blow dryer i also have here with me a heat protectant this is the peach black tea and vitamin fusion hairspray this is from the mood collection from the main choice and this is their thermal protection for curly or straight hair cool and i will be using the um daily hydration leave-in treatment from shea moisture 
just to kind of refresh my curls give them that little pop again all right guys let's go ahead and get into it we are going to see if the timeo air hype is really worth the hype and see if it is a good dupe for the dyson the very first thing i'm going to do is just part my hair evenly down the middle now it doesn't have to be perfect at first but all right so i'm just going to take this half and pin it up and out the way and then we'll just be working on one half at a time it's just going to be a lot easier for me i have a lot of hair so if you can work in sections if you also have a lot of hair it just makes more sense to do so all right and then with this section what i'm going to do is just split it down the crown of my head right to my ear and it's going to evenly part my hair from back to front and we'll twist this half up and out the way first and we'll tackle the back section all right so here's our back section right here before we go in any farther let me go ahead and apply the thermal protection first we're just going to do a few sprays like I said this product is a little sticky so I'm not going to do too much once I farther break it down I'll put the leave-in on there now oh it does smell good I will say that all right so in order for us to blow dry our hair we are going to need to farther break down our hair so I'm just going to grab our first chunk of hair in the back and I don't want to do too much since I'm using a new blow dryer I just want to get acquainted with it first all right y'all we have our first section of hair right here now the very first thing I'm going to do is go in with my leave-in and just start to spray it Now, I don't want it too, too, too wet, but I just want to get a little bit more moisture back in there. And then I'm going to start to go in with my detangling comb or my wide tooth comb. And I just start at the ends. And I did wash my hair and I also detangled in the shower. So my hair really should not be that knotty. As you guys can see, the comb is really just gliding through the hair, which is good. All right, and then just for safe protection, we're going to go in with the Cosmology Paddle Comb. I'll have this link below for you guys. I absolutely love this paddle comb. The bristles are amazing on here. They're just wide tooth and they're easy to glide through your hair. So you can see my hair is all nice and detangled. Now we are ready to get started with the Air Hype blow dryer. I'm just going to play around with the heat setting and see how I want it. So you guys won't be able to hear me talking. So give me one second so I can just adjust it to how I want it. Okay y'all so that is so cool. For the high and low setting for the heat once you touch it the light will come on but the if it's on low the light will be like really small and if it's um, on medium it'll get bigger and then if it's on high heat it gets like it's fully illuminated so let me show you guys what that looks like once you you won't be able to hear me but just watch so you'll turn it on and then you'll have to hit this bottom button right here to adjust the heat setting and then you'll see the light kind of like slowly start to change just watch Okay, yeah, so that is pretty cool. The airflow is really good and powerful, but it's not too noisy. And I like this so far. I love that you can see the light go up as you are adjusting the heat in the airflow setting. So I'm gonna go ahead on low heat and high speed, and let's see if we can get through this. All right, guys, so I just finished doing my first one. It took me about a minute and a half. And again, I'm just trying to get used to the blow dryer. So it's taking me a little bit longer. Um, but as we continue to go through my hair, I'm sure it will pick up some speed. It is very soft. It is very soft and it did a very good job. I did crank it up to medium heat um, towards the end just to kind of get like bone straight, I guess you can say. But it did a very, very good job. So let's continue to move on. I'm like really impressed so far, guys. I am very impressed. All right, so I'm just going to take my next section. And because it's so powerful, your sections actually don't have to be too small. Like, I'm doing a good medium-sized section for the back. So I'm going to go in again with the Shea Moisture Daily Hydration Leave-In. And we're just going to spray it. So we're just going to spray, spray, spray. Nothing crazy. And then I'm just going to rub in that spray. I think it's also the spray that's making my hair really soft, too. Now I'm just using a wide-tooth comb. And I already detangled, so we really shouldn't have too many problems. But you always want to use a wide tooth comb and then start to go in with a smaller bristle brush or a smaller comb. And then you can go in with an even smaller comb after that. So let me go ahead and turn this on and we'll get through this.
Wow, this thing is really, really powerful. The amount of pressure and airflow that is coming out of this little gadget is literally mind-blowing. So far, so good. It's making my hair very soft and straight. And I can't wait to get done this side so we can do a side-by-side -side comparison. But it's very soft, it's flowy, and it's literally exactly what I wanted. So I am so happy with my results so far. And I'm just going to continue to work my hair up. I think that I like this because it's easy to use. Like, there's not a lot of buttons on here there's no digital display or anything it's very very basic and easy to use and that's what some people are looking for how do I just turn it on and press it so it can go and work and if that's something that you're looking for if you don't need all the gadgets and buttons and stuff like that that just gets a little bit confusing for you and you need something that's a little bit more simplified then this probably is the one for you there's one button in the back to turn it on two buttons in the front one to control the airflow one to control the heat and that's it so I like it because it's super easy to use and it's affordable and it's getting the job done It's making me happy y'all. I am I'm pretty happy right now All right, so we only got like two more sections to go in the back We are flying through this and I'm just gonna go ahead and make sure everything's in the back That's already finished and here's the front you can see it's just kind of poofy and it's a little dry so we need to do something it's literally just been in a bun for like three days i washed it and i was very unmotivated to do my hair because i just didn't know what to do so when the air hype timeo came in the mail it's like i know exactly what i want to do so this is exciting and i'm just going through the motions of detangling my hair starting with the biggest comb and you just want to go at those ends and then I'm just gonna go ahead and work my way up. It's very easily to de it's very easy to detangle my hair because again, it's already detangled from my wash day. But I do just like to go in and make sure, very very gently, I can go in and just comb it out. Amazing. All right, and now we get to go to work with the dryer. Um, another thing that I'm doing is when I'm blow drying my hair, I have it down like this. Like I'm going, I'm not having it like that or like that. The blow dryer is literally down like that. The comb is down. Everything is going down in effect like that. It's just a lot easier for my hair to be like that. So that's a tip for you guys when you are blow drying your hair. Have your hair have the blow dryer facing the comb attachment part is facing down. Okay, so it's taken me roughly a minute and a half to two minutes per section, which is not bad at all. And I just love how straight it is. I love how long my hair is getting. I love how silky it feels. Like, this is it right here, y'all. This is it. All right, so let me just go ahead and knock out this last section in the back, and then we'll get to the front. All right, y'all, and just like that, the back is all finished. Look, looks so good. Oh my goodness. Hair is just long, pretty, flowy, all the way down my back. It feels amazing. I am really, really liking the Time Melt Air Hype. This is really the perfect dupe um, for the Dyson. I don't know about y'all, but this is my go-to. Now we have to do the front. So I'm just taking that clip out. Here is the front, y'all. I don't think it's gonna take me long at all. I have less hair. In the front as well and my hair is a little bit more finer in the front the back of my hair tends to be a little bit more thicker so right now I'm just parting off my next section of hair that I want to do yeah this isn't going to take me long at all I probably have like three sections up here and then we can hop to the other side so like I've been doing I'm just taking the leave-in spraying it all over that section y'all see it y'all see it all right so here we go i'm moisturizing or i'm working that into my hair now and then starting with a wide tooth comb at the ends and my hair is pretty detangled so i shouldn't have too much problems so we're just going to comb it out and then we're going to use this paddle comb and comb it out again double triple check to make sure all those knots are gone and I just love using this comb. This is the um, Cosmology Paddle Comb. All right, so we are all ready to go. We're just going to go ahead and turn it on and do what we've been doing. I'm starting off on high speed, low heat, and then I just crank the heat up to medium heat when I'm like almost done just to like shock it straight. And that's it. All right, so now that our hair is just about done, I'm just gonna take my paddle comb and start to work through my hair. Get everything nice and uniformed and straight. OMG, y'all. 
loving it loving it like i would not want this any other way this is so beautiful can you guys believe that i'm already at the top like this is insane so what i'm just gonna do is split this evenly in half and this this will be my last two sections for this side i'm gonna clip this front half up and out the way and just focus here on the back and i'm just working that product in All right, y'all, so I just finished blow drying the right side of my hair. All I'm doing now is just getting everything even and straight simply by taking my big paddle comb and brushing it through. And I must say, I'm very, very happy with my results. Are you guys wanna see a side-by-side -side comparison? Like, just look, it's so fluffy, it's so full. So let me show you guys the other side, just to show you guys that I'm not playing. This really does a really good job. Look at the difference, y'all. Like this side is like, what is going on? You can see this side's much longer. Everything is straight. It's a little bit more shinier. It's softer. It feels really good to touch. This side's just like crinkled and wrinkled and you can tell it's just been sitting in a bun for the past few days. So this is the result of the Air Hype Timo, y'all. Look at the side by side comparison. I am literally blown away. So what I'm gonna do now is just go ahead and knock out the other side off camera so I don't bore you guys to death. And then I will be back to show you guys the results once both my sides are finished. But so far, so good. This little tiny guy has a lot of power, y'all. I'm not playing. There's so much power and force coming out of this little small gadget. So let me go ahead and do the other side and I'll be right back, y'all. But if you guys are liking the video, if you're liking my review of the Time Out air hype blow dryer then make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe my name is Aaliyah I love doing natural hairstyles for you guys and showing you guys all different types of ways for you to care for your natural hair so make sure you guys subscribe all right y'all without further ado I'll be right back hey y'all so I am back and I just finished blow drying my entire head the other side is finally done I'm just combing it out making sure all the knots are out and that everything just looks even and perfect and y'all here are the results of me using the Timo Air Hype blow dryer. So, so, so happy, y'all. So this bad boy put in some work today, y'all. My favorite things about the Air Hype blow dryer is that it's small and easy to store away. I also like that you can adjust the airflow and heat flow settings on here, and you know which one you're at by the lighting. The lighting will range from low, medium, and high on the back, so you know what airflow setting you're at. At. and then I also love that there's a no heat setting as well or like like a cool shot or a cool flow you can turn the heat completely off which is great and if you don't need if you don't use any heat then you don't need a heat protectant either and also for the girlies who are on a budget or just does doesn't want to really splurge on hair care products then this is definitely the blow dryer for you it has the same force and the same power as a Dyson but it's literally one seventh of the price also it's quiet as well it's not loud whatsoever and the results are absolutely amazing soft silky smooth beautiful blown out hair it didn't take me long whatsoever i didn't really um experience any tugging or pulling with this at all i didn't really have a lot of hair fall whatsoever because i did detangle in the shower that is very important that your hair is detangled before you go in and blow dry your hair and we took extra steps by detangling with two combs additionally on top of the comb attachment to the air hype so that is about it y'all i just wanted to review this for you i took it freshly out of the box used it for the first time and gave you guys my honest review this is definitely as always Aaliyah approved and if you guys are looking for a blow dryer this just may be your next one so definitely check out all the information below where i will have links to everything where you guys can go and see for yourself more information on the air hype and then also all the 
other products I use and hair tools will be linked below as well. If you guys have any questions at all, please DM me or email me at as always Aaliyah and make sure that you guys are following Timo on their social medias as well so you can stay up to date with their latest and greatest releases. All right, y'all. So without further ado, me and my hair are about to go and relax. This is exactly what I wanted. I am so happy, y'all. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys love natural hair just as much as I do. And my name is Aaliyah. This is as always Aaliyah, where we always keep it real. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Deuces.